Hello, everyone. RPG Kingdom Kid here, back with some more. Dot Hack GU Last Recorded, Volume 2, Remem. Uh, Remissance, right? Is that what it is? Yeah, rem Remissance. In the previous video, we got things back to normal for now, I think. Also, Crimson Versus is out. Uh, we will look at that later. But for now, let's check out our mail, because uh, we've got some important mails to look at. What's your hobby? Come and fight with me. What's your hobby? CC Corp. Dear Haseo, thank you for the regular patrons at the world. This is the information that you... This is to inform you that the following campaigns have now ended. The Stray... Ah, uh, Grunty, yep. Chimps Kicker, already got that. Big Man's Model? What the fuck? I thought... No, I thought... Uh, I thought the only way to do that was in... Volumes... Uh, whatever. In the latest upgrade, the following changes have been made to the game. Battle, dual sword actions. Following changes have been made to dual sword. Com... Emotion, charge, broadsword. Okay. <sighs> Thank you for converting your data to dot hack GU volume two reminiscence. We are pleased to present you with the following bonuses for conversation. GP has been added to your GP to your existing GP brought over. I am set we have added additional items to your existing inventory over from GU. If you do not have enough empty slots in inventory, you will receive GP value to the value of the items. Most movies, you add three movies to the movie player. Doppelganger's weapon. If you defeat a doppelganger dot hack GU Volume 1 Rebirth and got the key item own king, you receive the doppelganger only weapon Heinz invitation by defeating a doppelganger in the game. Yep, I already did that. Very relieved to have made it back to the real world. Saki and Salkova made it back safe as well. That was truly an unbelievable experience, wasn't it? I'm still... I still can't, can't quite believe that our minds were trapped inside the game. So I'm about my symptoms. I can talk in real life now, but I can't feel anything in the tip of my hand. It's in the exact spot where my character was cracked. I'm a little scared. When I went to the hospital, the doctor told me that my symptoms resembled those of Doll Syndrome. But he couldn't tell me what could have caused them. I thought I would... If I want to get back to the real world, what should I do, Oseo? Do you have a little time to talk? If you do, please meet me at the front of the fountain at the Alchemy District. Her hand is paralyzed, so the real Adelie is... There's no way a doctor can help her. The problem's got to be Ida. Alright. Okay, let's go back... ...to where it all began. Deleted. This post has been deleted by admin. Deleted by admin. Deleted by an admin. Or please calm down. Even if what you are all saying is true, no one believe you with posts like this. While it is true that there were some server problems, actually the server crashed for a while. The last few minutes, it was nowhere near the length of your time you have mentioned. This is a few. If you do, if you wish to deny, you can simply. Guess well, others made a big deal. That doesn't seem likely. It's just me or does the elves seem suspicious to me. Gotta write this down. Ingrid, Alice, Hiroko, Fatal, Jack, Theo. If you mind telling me her, your stories, I'll whisper to you in town. So anyway, man, I only request that you allow me to sit in on your chat. On another note, it's amazing how thoroughly this conversation has, it's amazing how thoroughly this conversation has been deleted. Sure, it's fine. Maybe there's something shady going on in the background here. It's fucked up. Alright, Atali. Alright, baby girl. Atali is waiting for us at the water fountain, down in the Alchemy District. Excuse me, waiting for us? Uh, okay. Oh. I thought it was like right here, so that's why I didn't bother doing anything. I thought 
thought that Pikmin's one can't be done in Volume 1. Maybe it can. I don't know. I'll double check. Hey, girl. I probably shouldn't check this while I'm recording. Are you sure Whoopsie, you want to bad. keep going with the world? <laughs> I mean, aren't you scared? Oh. Come on. It's not like the world's going to go away. So why not just take some time off? Of course I'm scared. I'm scared, but... But I'm not going to quit the world, ever! <sighs> After all, I can tell. This isn't anything that a doctor can cure. If I don't do my best here, it'll never be healed. Yeah. There's... Well, shit. There's nothing I can do for Adderley, is there? Probably not. So I have an avatar now. So what? Nothing's changed at all. First Shino, and then Adelie. I can't save anyone by myself. You can't save anyone. And also, don't forget the fact that Sakaki is here. God, I don't care. And... Maseo? You're not feeling well, are you? If you have time in the game, you should rest up. Oh. Okay. Well then. I'm such an idiot. Yes, you are. It's here in the world where Adelie seems to feel most at home. After all, this is where Sakaki is. You've got mail. Oh, goody! My favorite portion of this game. Log out and check your email. God, I fucking hate this. Okay. How are you? Is everything alright now that you're back? I'm doing fine. It's as if I never left. Being trapped inside the world just seems like a bad dream now. You got an email from Adelie, right? I got one too, which is why I'm writing you this one now. Actually, I'm at my part-time job. I have to be real careful not to get spotted by my boss. Otherwise, he'll cut my paycheck on the spot. It's not too easy, though. Apparently, she went to the hospital with her mother, and now they think she might have Doll Syndrome. Just hope that the results of her other tests have some good news. She also said that Yata told her all about Ada and GU, but frankly, I don't think there was any need to tell her now. What do you think? Seriously, what on earth could he be thinking? Even after we get back, even after we got back from the Ida serve, serve that my boss came by to check on us, and I hit the send button by accident when I tried to hide my cell phone. Anyway, as as I was saying, Ida's Atolis. I can say that their names right. Well. Ali's condition didn't heal completely even after we got back from the Ida server. In that case, there's only one thing we can do. Get back Adelie's epitaph from the Ad Ada. It's our only choice. I bet Yata is investigating it whereabouts right now. Plan to go ask him about it once I'm done with this job. You'll come along too, right? Then let's meet up in front of Ravens at home. OPS, it seems like Adelie still needs to process all the new stuff. I'm surprised seeing what's happened and all. Be nice to her and see if she's okay, okay? 
Looks like Adelie wrote Kuhn an awfully detailed email. I guess she really is putting some distance between us after the whole Sakaki thing. <clears throat> Come to Raven's at home. Well, guess I'll go to Raven's at home for now. Yeah, see, yeah, I'm, I'm looking at the trophy guide for that Bickman's model thing, and it says it's easier in Volume 2, so I guess it reopens in Volume 2. So, it's I think it's Volume 2 where I have to do that. Alright, I'll worry about that, though, off screen. Off, off. Ugh. I'll worry about that when I'm not playing. Uh, when I'm not online playing, a little, oh my god, when I'm not recording. Jeebus. Cause there's no excuse. Let's go to Raven's at home. Alright, let's go to the Raven's at home. I think everything else had to be done on the previous volume. So I'm sure I did, yeah, I'm pretty sure I did everything that I needed to do in the previous volume. That could only be done in the previous volume. Let's go. Nothing happened? After all that, you're telling me that nothing happened? How the hell can that be? Yet, it is a fact that nothing happened. What the real world saw was practically nothing. The time we spent in the Ida server was only a few minutes in the real world. As far as everyone is concerned, the whole thing was nothing more than some network trouble. But, but there were real life players losing consciousness during that time. Look at the response in the news reports and forums. No one, except for those directly involved in the incident, believe that it is even possible, let alone true. Oh goody. So you're saying we should just let it go? Oh yeah, that's rich. Paseo, watch your tongue! Shut up! Just how important is this guy anyway? He's always acting all wise and knowledgeable, but he never does anything useful when it counts! Boom. And on top of that, he tried to use all of us as his own personal laboratory guinea pigs. Disgusting. There's nothing special about him. He's just a coward. The anger that you are displaying stems from Adelie's player, right? There is no need to worry. I'm well aware of her unfortunate symptoms. Oh, really? Well, good for you. So now what are you going to do about it? Hmm. <laughs> Please exactly. enlighten Exactly, that's me. what I thought. What's the great and mighty Master Yada going to do? Any ideas, huh? We are currently tracing the problematic Ida. As long as we can retrieve her epitaph from Ida, her symptoms should heal completely. 
So, do you have a problem with that? A problem? You bet I do. I'm sick of this Yada. Make an announcement about Ida and what just happened, and shut down the server! I mean, the CC Corp executives will listen to you if you talk to them, won't they? At this rate, there will only be more and more victims. Hmm. Yada! You wish us to make this information public without plans to solve the underlying problem? Ah, damn it. Are Steve you Bloom's aware right. There is a high probability that the panic on the Ida server would be repeated in the real world if we did what you propose. <clears throat> hey, Yada. If you shut down the server, Epitaph users wouldn't be able to access the world either, right? Of course. In that case, I'm completely against shutting it down. Why? Because I haven't settled my score with him. Him? Triage. That bastard is still around here. Aseo, are you still thinking only about yourself? After everything Adelie's been through? Myself? Hardly. The only one I'm thinking about is Shino. If you bring Shino back, I'll... Enough! I see how it is. I'm sorry, but I can't stay with you all any longer. I won't. I can't. Coon! Leave him be. He needs to cool off. But... He'll come back, you'll see. You think so? I think he's pissed for real. He's super pissed. Won't you be? He will have no choice but to come back. Oh, good. Once he calms down, he will understand that no matter how much he dislikes it, this is the only place with all the answers. If you say Never so. Never mind him. There is something I'd like to ask you. Oh, is there? Really now? Well, let huh? me hear it. Did you find anything of use in the Ida server's operation folder? <laughs> What's that this? O-Von thing? O-Von... Zero one. O-Von? Can't remember. If we were to shut down the world, not only would we lose the means to cure Atalie of her affliction, but we would also lose forever the means to restore consciousness to the Lost Ones, to Shino. Don't worry about it. As long as you keep your promise to me, I'll be happy to cooperate with you. However! Don't you dare utter Shino's name with that forked tongue of yours again! Even now, Shino's unable to return to the real world! Fuck you! Master Yada, are you sure that it's wise to continue operating the world as you've been? Rather than conducting investigations of regular players, Perhaps we should gather specialists on a closed server. Hi. Yes? Do you know where Ida's interest currently lies? No. no. Where? People. The reason that Ida is staying in the world is because there are so many things of interest present within it. If we shut down the server, Ida will cease to remain in the world, and will likely move its interest elsewhere. How? Where? As to what that chain of events would bring about, <clears throat> both in the <throat> world and beyond, even I cannot begin to imagine. We at GU 
must prevent the damage created by Ida from spreading. At the same time, we will gather Epitaph users and gain the power to confront it. That is our highest priority now. Right. Then go and do what you must. I await good results. Yes, Master Yada. God, I hate to watch her leave, but I love to watch her go. Who oh, the fuck are you? Yes. Hi, tall, dark, and slander. Slander? Slender? Project GU is progressing quite smoothly. Errors in our predictions are minor. There is no cause for concern. Oh. That is all well and good. But some of our superiors have concerns about your method of operation. Hmm. Fulfill your duties without any unnecessary thinking. Okay. Well, now what, I suppose? Masao, Gaspard's talking nonsense and won't listen to reason. Please come to Car Carnage at home as soon as you can. Syllabus doesn't know about what happened with the Ida server. I guess I should pay him a visit. Let's go to Canard's at home. Well, it's not so bad. We can do this quickly. Hey, Haseo, you gotta help me out. Syllabus said he won't believe me at all. Now, now, Gaspard. No matter how much fun the world may be, games and reality are totally separate things. Hmm. These guys don't need to know about Ida. Or avatars, for that matter. Yeah, Gaspard. How could something like that happen? <laughs> Lol. Haseo? But you were there too, weren't you? What? No. Huh? Hmm. No, I don't know what you're talking about. I mean, that's really weird. Was I just dreaming or something? Yes, that's what you were doing. Nothing but a dream. That's really odd. Was I just dreaming or something? You know, it sounds just like you to dream while you're playing. Of course, I also think it would be great if the world were to become real. No, you don't. This is how it should be. I can't let these guys get involved with Epitaphs and Ida. I think I kind of get why Kuhn left Canard, considering everything that's happened. Boy. Oh, maybe once the ones that are in second boost up from second, maybe I'll get the rest of the stuff that's in volume one or something like that. Maybe. Well, no oh yeah, I had an email. That's what I got. Ah, uh, might as well see what it is. It's like, well, what the fuck am I supposed to do now? I'm like, oh yeah, I got an email. Boom, 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 boom. If you wish. It seems that we both managed to return to the real world. Ordinarily, this would call for celebration, but apparently you don't feel like celebrating. If you've lost your way, I would be happy to talk to you about it. Come alone to Delta Hidden Forbidden Holy Ground. I'm sure that what happened to Shino and what happened to Atali is not just coincidence. If you truly wish to help, I plan to give you all the help I can. I'll be waiting for you at the Holy Ground. Ovan, how did he know about Atali? He probably knows more than what he's putting out there. You know, like everyone. Actually, hold on. I'm quite curious. I want to see how this uh, Crimson Versus thing that looks. Crimson Versus! 
Crimson Versus is an automatic card game. Create a deck, register for the battle arena, and battles will be conducted automatically with other players' decks. Battle nets you cards, which can be used to build stronger decks. Win matches to become number one in the rankings. You got the following cards. These cards have already been set inside your deck. You got a booster pack, Red Book Rebellion 2. You got the following cards. Try using the newly gained cards to add your deck. Choose a deck. Choose deck add under the card menu to go so. Okay. Here you can choose which deck you would like to edit. You can maintain a total of three decks and choose any one of the three to use for battle. Here you can choose which cards in your deck you wish to switch. Card types are mainly divided into generals and units. A single deck is made up of one general and three units. Wow, that is a small deck. Each general has a charisma stat which amounts to the maximum cost available to units. Also consider a card's abilities and its charisma cost to make the strongest deck you can. Here you can choose which cards you can add to a deck. If you wish to add more than one of the same card, you must have enough of that card in possession to do so. You can press square. You use a square. Oh. Common. Charisma 7, HP, AP. Okay. You have more HP but less AP. Trinity Assault. I'm a cards one. I have one of them and I have two of them. And then I have a Silvis. It says the highest charisma of all of them. And like a he's a nice medium, so. Okay, so. Oh yeah, I didn't. I didn't. Has no junction abilities. Okay. So I'm using seven out of nine of my charismas. Okay. Evades an attack from <clears throat> enemy general for only one turn. Deals three points of damage to the enemy general. Moves one. Junction ability gained <clears throat> through a junction shield element unit from an enemy general. Forces your general to take the first turn. If both parties have jun junction disability, it loses this effect. Deals one point of damage to an enemy general at the beginning of your turn. Adds 5 HP to your general. That's probably be a nice one to have. <clears throat> Adds 1 AP to your general. As one H AP to your general, reduce one HP at the beginning of each of your turns. As two AP to your general. As two AP at the end of each of your turns when your general goes first. Oh, so that's probably a good one to have with that um, that one that like always forces the general to take first. That's a good one, but I won't try that with this. Okay. All right, now, during your deck, you're using a practice battle. You can use the practice battle to pit one of your decks against another and verify your card's abilities. Okay. Practice battles allow you to battle two of your own decks. The battle will begin. First, choose the deck on the left side. Okay.
Oh, so your AP, oh, your AP is your attack power, okay. That's enough for me to lose, okay. Let's see how those against this one. Shit. Wow, okay. Gallery. You need to register your deck, you will use the bell before you can begin the battle. Please choose battle entry under Vistas to register your deck. Fine, I'll register this one for now. Reverse friend, please choose end and return to the desktop. A battle will take place automatically once every minute. Battles will take place even while visiting the world. Return to the visit blah, 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 blah. Okay. Seems like a lot. Well, let's walk around for a little bit in the world, and then I want to see, like, how many, um... Okay, let's just walk around a little bit in the world, see, like, what happens. Ovan summoned me. I'm to go to Delta Hidden Forbidden Holy Ground by myself. God, what a dread. Can I even invite anyone to my party, I'm wondering? Nope, everyone's offline or busy. Because fuck you, that's why. Oh, Emperor. Oh, yeah, that's right. I'm a fucking Emperor. Fuck you. I'm kidding. Right, I want to, I'm quite curious about a few things here. I guess their quest! Nope. Okay. Ride around for a little bit. We'll see how my versus deck is doing. Yeah, I'm I'm really enjoying this. Like I I really do enjoy this game. Uh, when I first played Volume One, I still really do hate the whole. Oh, you got an email. Log out and check it. Okay. All right. I logged back in. All right. We did one cutscene. All right. You got an email. Log out and check it. Like, I really hate that. That's like the one gripe I'm having about this so far. It's not a gripe, so... It's not really a gripe yet, but it's like a whole... Like, I'm at level 50. I'm at the max level that you can be in Volume 1. So... It sucks that, like... It sucks that the... That the stuff in the, uh... Quote-unquote... Tutorial... If you... I won't really necessarily call it a tutorial, but it felt like it. But, um... It really sucks that the errors that they put you through in the story before you're able to, like, you know, do this, before you're able to, like, come back to reality wasn't really that much of a challenge for me. Sure, probably some people don't level up all the way to the... to the level. To the max level. But it's good if they do, because then you could get to level 150 a lot sooner and such. But I digress. Okay, let's check out my uh, Crimson Verses, and then uh, and then we'll end the part here. Cause we've gotten in quite a bit, so let's check out how the Crimson Verses are doing. Oh shit! I said something about Crimson Verses. Wasn't reading it. Since last time, three battles have been played. Three wins. Sweet. Once battle results have been posted, you can use log to see what happens during the battle. Viewing your log will let you see how you use how you need to edit your deck in order to win. Choose log on reverse menu to see your log. The screen lets you view logs of the last 20 battles. Choose a log you wish to view and press X to see 
its contents. Here you can see your win-loss record and what decks or other PCs use. Use the information about the opponent. Opponent players' decks contain trends, for example, when snipe trinities are, in, are the trend, opponent decks will have the snipe cards. Putting together a deck with a tra trinity that is well suited to defeat the opponent's current trinity trend will make it easier to win battles. So it's basically all right. They both knock out. All right, they both knocked out each other, and since I had the most HP, I won this one. You win. You win. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Rewind. Sales unit card. March of destruction cost two versus cost three. Can I check out car gallery? Oh, so you're an assist. You're an ass assault, I mean. There's snipe, assault, 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 shield, okay. You win. All right, well, guys, I think I'm gonna end the part off here. I know it's a little... Uh, I know not too much stuff has happened, but it's... Still, I think it's a nice place to lay off. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching this video. If you liked the video, please give that like button a click. Comment down below what you like about the video, what you didn't like about the video. Let me know. Do you think, uh, who do you think was that guy with a yata and such? A lot of crazy stuff going on, that's for sure. So, yeah. And as always, guys, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss a beat. And subscribe to the main channel, too. That's in the description below. As well as follow me on Twitter. Both my main Twitter, RBG Kingdom Kid Twitter, are in there, too. I want to thank you all so much for watching once again. And I'll see you all next time.